Hey, Angela Wolf here, and did you know there is a new Luminaire XP3? Of course, the one and the two are amazing, but they added more. <laughs> so first, take a look at this. I love this because I like a little bling. So when you take off the lid, check it out. Super fun, very different, will match my studio fabulously. All right, not only that, I love lace sleeves. I love big embroidery designs. So the XP3 has everything that the one and two had, but more. Check out these designs. I can see, oh, actually, I think it matches my dress. That was not even planned. <laughs> so I love the bigger designs. There's more embroidery, there's tapering stitches. So let me just give you a quick look. First of all, check out the new stylus. We don't have to go buy a new one anymore. Brother's giving us one with this. Scroll through here. Let's just check out the embroidery first. In here, you'll see a couple new sections. Look at these big designs. So this is one that I used for my dress. And when you see this here, you have the full design, three hoopings. It walks you through the hoopings. Remember those snowman stickers? We're still using them because they're fabulous for placement. So we have that. There's the one big design, or you can split it up and do different ones. Here's the deal. If you're new to embroidery, don't be afraid. You literally stop that first section it tells you put the snowman here, you put it there, you move your fabric, do it again, drink some coffee while you watch the beautiful embroidery. So that's one section. And I'm gonna take you back. Let's go back through here to embroidery. Here's a new section, long stitch designs. Check these out. So here's a few here, you might see. They're very different. They almost look like hand stitching, but you're drinking a cup of coffee while they go through. So you've got these on here. Here's more. These would be fabulous on any kid's garment, on sleeves. I'm pretty addicted to embroidering sleeves and jeans. But home deck, quilts, you name it. Speaking of quilting, you all know that I'm not a big quilter, but I love to design fabric, so that's why we get along so well. Let's look at this new section here in the quilting. Oh, isn't that beautiful? All right, I'm going to take you back to the embroidery right through here. You might remember these designs from the X, well, XP1 and XP2, they added more. We've got the hexagon. Now we have edge to edge quilting. I used to always think, what is that? <laughs> then I tried it and I can design a whole piece of fabric for anything, a garment, a quilt. Actually, now you can do your own quilting at home. So grab one of these. I can't decide which one's my favorite yet because I like them all. Here you go, that's the design. Well, maybe your fabric or quilt's a different size than mine. Look at this. You can put in your measurements. You go, you tell it what hoop size you want. It embroiders, and again, you move from one to the other to the other. You can't even screw it up. <laughs> it's fabulous. I keep saying, how can they come up with anything better? Well, since I sew about 90% of my life, I'm gonna take you to the sewing section and look at this new little category. I'll give you a hint. It starts with a T. Tapering. All right, if you scroll through the top here, there we go. You've got all of these 20 different tapering, not just one or two. I was thinking, well, maybe it'll be a couple boring stitches. No, they outdid themselves, as brother always does. Here, look, check that stitch out. Now, the really cool part is they give you a lot of options how this stitch is gonna start and stop. So in here, scroll down the bottom and you'll see a new little, looks like a knife. Now, there are different ways that you can use this stitch. That'll be a whole different tutorial. By the way, that will be in your XP3 masterclass because I have added five more amazing lessons with projects to show you how to use this. But in the meantime, here's the short of it. There's a knife, there's your endpoint sticker, which we're all loving. Snowman with the snowball, remember those? They're still here. All right, so there's the knife. And in here you have all of these options, how you're gonna start the stitch, how you're gonna end it, and as you press this, it actually shows you right on the screen. You can decide how many different stitches you want, you can put them into memory. I can't remember, but I think it's like three that you can put in the memory. So if you're doing a big project and you're going back and forth to the stitches, it works perfectly. All right, so for those of you that are totally new to the Luminaire, well, you remember the Move It Foot? The other one was a little bigger. It's small, it's slim, it works great. So if you were working on big projects, you might have seen me on YouTube doing that, and sometimes I would get a little frustrated because it would kind of get stuck in the back. 
well, it was part my fault, but <laughs> now the foot's smaller and it glides right over. So the new and improved move it foot. Check this out. Couching, yeah, couching is still, there's an attachment for the machine and check out these letters. This is gonna make a great gift. I hope my sisters aren't watching because they might know what they're getting this time. But this is so super cool. So this is all yarn. This would be great for a bag, kids going off to college, school, you name it. All right, there's so much more. I know I don't have a lot of time, so let's just go through a few more things that you can't miss. We still have our amazing huge hoop. It's so big I can actually do my whole sleeve, right? But now there's an added item that you can grab from your dealer, the magnetic hoop, 10 by 10. I absolutely love this. I used it for all of the new designs. They fit in there great. In fact, the sleeves I made for my dress, I did all with this hoop right here. So, brother started the magnetic hoops a couple years ago on the Luminaire and they've only gotten better and different sizes. So you might wanna grab this one from your dealer. But what's included in the box? That's the most important part. Do you remember a foot that looks like this? from the XP1, maybe a while ago. I don't remember which machine, but it's not the same. It's new and improved. It has more of a slide here. As one of my friends says, if your foot's on here, it fits there perfect and it doesn't fall off the side. So this comes with the machine, so you can program each right here and right here to do, I don't know, I usually set mine up for cutting the stitches, putting the foot up, needle down, whatever. You have a lot of options in there and you can change it very easily in the menu. So this is in the box. Fabulous, brother always seems to know what we like. And guess what? There's a longer cord, yay! For those of you that like to sew standing up or maybe use a sewing cabinet, it works great. All right, last but not least, let's go into the sewing side. There we go. Right back in here, we still have this stylus, although we have the smaller one now because it's perfect for using my design center if you want to sketch. So now you have two in the box. And on the sewing side, you still have the option with our fabulous projector. That was the big kicker for the XP. When that projector came out, everyone was like, wow. Actually, it works for embroidery and sewing. And if you mess up on embroidery, which I've done, <laughs> I actually went back, used the projector, it shows it right on the fabric for perfect placement. We can still do it though for stitches. So let's just scroll across here, let's do a decorative stitch. Maybe you haven't used this yet, or you forgot about it, or you're new to our fabulous Luminaire series. <laughs> I love it, one, two, three. Here we go. And look right here. You can still, you can change the color of the background depending on what color your fabric is. That makes it very nice. You can also use these here to change stitches, to change length. I have used this so much because you can actually see one of the many, many, many decorative stitches right on your fabric. And you can see the width of it. How many times did you have to do a stitch like that? Sew a stitch, I should say. And you're like, oh, that was way too skinny or way too wide or you don't like it. Those are not fun to rip out. So in this case, you can see exactly what it looks like. Once you have what you want, just click set. And there you go, you can start sewing. Did I mention that there are a couple new fonts too? All right, here we go. Scroll over to the side. And yes, I'm using my finger. I could use a stylus or my finger. You've got all these options, it just depends. For those of you that lose your stylus in the studio all the time, you can use your finger. All right, so here's some great letters. When you click on these, it shows up here on the screen. Click embroidery. And there's the projector. And you can see it right here. So if you're trying to put a monogram somewhere, as you move the little red box around on this screen, it shows you here exactly where it is. It makes it so easy for placement. It takes the fear out of that. Okay, what about my design center? There are a couple new things there, but one is huge. So we already had some wonderful fills. Go in here. Let's just make a shape. Guess what? Now, when I'm trying to teach you how, or any of the educators are trying to teach you how to use a project on here, 
all of the shapes are numbered. So now we don't have to say, click here, we can tell you actually which one we're clicking. Oh, I think brother thought you might want to know that. <laughs> must have been in the top list because everybody was like hooping and hollering over that. So now you can pick a shape, click OK. Once it's here, you can still add some of your beautiful fills. And there are a few more. Scroll to the bottom. These are beautiful. Actually, each year I'm kind of like, oh, what'll come up new? Well, check this one out. As I mentioned, I love to design fabric, so this is even going to get better. So you can also now, you can resize, you can do a lot of different things in here, different than before, even just a little better. Put your dimensions in. But when I was in here, do you see this up here? It says custom. Like, ooh, what's that? So for all of you that use PE11, you can design your fills, bring them to this machine, and adjust them in the machine to fit your project. Brother makes it easier and easier and easier. Not into software? No worries. Did you see all these other ones you have to choose from? I think you're golden. And then once you pick those, you still have options to skew them, to size them. I don't know. I think you could play for a long time and you'll never get through them. All those beautiful decorative stitches I showed you, now there's a new and improved end foot. Take a look at this. You still have the fabulous box to put all of your goodies in. And there's even a slot for it. I'll set it right here so you can see this. See the little plastic pieces on each side? When this goes onto the foot, it keeps it sturdy. And the bottom side, I don't know the technical term, I would just call it super slippery because it goes over fabrics of any kind, full leather, all the tricky fabrics you have, no problem now and you have the little stabilization on the side. So the new end foot comes with the machine, and I know, you have the XP1 or XP2, no worries. You can get that one from your brother dealer too. All right, there's so much more that comes with this machine. As you know, this machine is amazing. But again, you have access to my masterclass for a limited time. I did it with the XP2, so all of those lessons are included. There was no reason to go back and change it just because of the beauty of the machine, because all of that is included in here. But we have added additional lessons showing you how to do some of the long designs, edged edge quilting. I've got some fun projects for you. And there's another bonus in there where you can embroider and use your scan and cut to talk to each other with my connection, because it's still in here. So I gave you a great tutorial on that too. So when you register your machine, you'll get an email, have access to the class. So I will look forward to seeing you in class. In the meantime, enjoy your XP3, go visit your brother dealer, check this out. And for those of you with the XP1, XP2, they have an upgrade kit that includes a lot of the extra accessories that I showed. So check it out and I will look forward to seeing you in class and online. See you later.